watch my cousins who were boys playing football from a young girl around the age of five and six and then I joined a school team around the age of eight or nine and some of the girls at school were playing for a local grassroots team so I thought I'll go along to training and I just found it was so relaxed, it was so fun and I found I've never left the game since. I'm still playing football now over 10 years later and I found a love for coaching in the meantime and my passion for that's really growing and I love um, passing my experiences on to the younger generation as well. <laughs> I find when I'm playing football it's more of an escape to the real world and I find I can just relax and I can have fun playing with my teammates. Um, I also find when I'm coaching I love to see the girls doing the same thing. I love to see the girls having a laugh, making new friends and just having fun while they're playing football. <laughs> Greatest achievement as a player would be playing for England under 14 schools and I remember the national tournament where we got selected I scored the winning goal in the tournament so that was definitely my greatest achievement as a player. Um, as a coach at Hetton Juniors I joined the club with no girls teams and very few girls at the club to now having seven girls teams in addition to the Wildcats, the squad girls and the pathway to the women's session as well. <laughs> develop myself as a coach and achieve my UEFAC qualification as soon as possible. I'd also like to increase the opportunities available to females in the area. I believe that everyone should have the access to play football and I also think it's important to develop the number of female coaches that are working in the area as well. <laughs> football for Spenny Moor Town Ladies. I'm the female, the, the girls development officer at Hetton Juniors Football Club. I coach the girls wildcat sessions, the squad girls sessions and I coach the women's recreational session as well. Um, I also coach the Emerging Talent Centre for Durham Women under 10 and under 12 girls and I coach at Sedgefield PDC as well. <laughs> would definitely be going to tournaments as a young girl and um, travelling down on the bus on a Friday night together and staying over with all our families and friends and just spending time together and appreciate and just playing grassroots football and having a laugh with your friends. I think as a player there's loads of opportunities out there, there's Wildcat centres, there's squad girls, there's plenty of teams. If you're unsure on where to start, contact your county FA and they'll direct you to the best place. But I think just take every opportunity and just make sure that you're having fun. That's the most important thing. And as a coach, I think the hardest step might be the first step. But once you get past that, the rewards will pay off and you won't regret it. <laughs>